When I say Mamunzobe, she knows I'm not referring to her. I'm referring to my comrades. Uma Munzo, Uma Konzo. We 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 are happy that you are at that level, that you are participating in your own country. When we met in this in our homes, we do have homes in Africa. We stayed in Africa for us to achieve our, our democracy, which indeed is a platform for us to do this work and rebuild our country, our continent, and also extend hands beyond it because you are capable. We are, till now we depend on you, till now we trust you, and we wish that you, you have enjoyed Africa at this level. Enjoying your Africa, you see your, your blue dots, your, your, your blue waters of your, your sea. Uh, you also know that uh, you have these hills and hillocks rolling down. And with the breeze, that you will really keep you enjoying. If we are to develop, we are not looking for big buildings. We are not looking for any other hazards, but just check our own as Africa green falling floor and see how happy families we are. We shouldn't be running for things that really, really our parents didn't uh, matter. They must, they, their matter was to, to protect their land, promote peace, travel by night, whether you're a woman or you're a man, and sing very loudly alone, because there was no fear. There was actually no threat. Yes, threats are coming in very various ways, but together we can actually design, develop, implement strategies that may bring peace, stability, and also ensure that we grow our economy and don't rush for things that destroy our future. Remember your signatures in, in, in Beijing. Remember the National Environmental Management Act of this country, which tells us that the land we are in now is not ours. We have borrowed it from future generations. And therefore, we must work together to protect them and try that we defeat climate change, we use methodologies that will sustain our future, our future generation. I wish when you go to your country, you are able to remember rural women. They are starting out there. Remember our young people, you may your science, your technology, your research will help us to get medicines, even if you are in this process area in your country. I must call you South Africans. animal. Yes, you are in South Africa. Therefore, I must refer to you in that name. The kings here, they are old people. They really, really are talking about we are progressing. They are, they have their own challenges. There are issues. But at the end, this business is not known by many people. Uh, if you were if you were actually in the mini fields, you would be sweating. But I do know we sweated a lot the three days. Uh, on behalf of the Department of Agriculture, Land Reform and Rural Development, and the entire department of our country, including their nine provinces. We say we salute you. We say thank you. And specifically, we congratulate uh, the new chair. We salute those who have kept the fire burning up until today. We will always give uh, 
from your, your, your resource. Please keep it full for all of us. I don't know This is anyway a way of, of a, a, a ensuring that uh, I send my heartfelt thanks and uh, may you travel safely back home. Wow, let's give, let's give a, a warm applause again. I can see a standing ovation. Yeah, you can see speaking from Indeen, you know, speaking from her heart. She says we should not thank the communities don't have anything, they have very useful indigenous knowledge. She has also mentioned to us that we should not forget about our youth, we should invest in the youth, and she has also mentioned that we should not destroy our environment, and that whatever we have today, whether it is soil or water, it is not for us, it is uh, something that we are keeping as an investment for the future and for the future generations. So she's giving us all these very important uh, lessons and uh, we really appreciate uh, the Honourable Minister uh, for these very, very important uh, closing uh, messages. Thank you all so very much.